What's up everybody, Gaming Gargle here, and welcome back to Season 3, Episode 41 of Sayleg. Oh, we're trying out something new now, guys. We are getting our our gargoyle working hard here in the making some ex, uh, excess uh, gold medallions while the business hours are shut down. So between 7.30 a.m. and 4 p.m. We're just going to let him go for like 24-7, see what we can get out of this. Um, there is a bit of an issue with the supervising. I have uh, mentioned that over to Stardog. So um, he's looking into it right now, trying to recreate the problems and that and see what uh, he can do about it. So, uh, hey, guard dog, or guard dude, how you doing tonight? Ooh, look at that. We're selling the goods in the morning. Making that money. Oh, very nice. So we'll go until 20 after 7. Look at all that beautiful money's coming in. All right, we got one fellow off to work. All right, so we're gonna pause. We're gonna tell the gargoyle to come here. And then we'll tell him to supervise, and we'll see what we got going on here. So he was able to get us two out of that. All right. So there we go. We got the three supervisors. We're going to come over here, click. Now we're going to set him off to make some gold jewelry. Okay, so as you can see, with three of the guys going on it, that gold moves real quick. All right, so let's not abandon all our other places. So the soup kitchen, working hard making soup. We got lots of porridge here. Let's just squeeze this together so we can see what we're missing. Ooh, might need some more vegetables at some point. The liquor store going strong. Yeah, doing really well actually. Bakery, they're still doing their thing. Leather worker. All right, looks like we can get this gentleman working on the leather armor. Oh, 720, I just love that. That's just beautiful. What is the recipe for that one again? One and one, right? Oh, eight and one. That's a little on the ridiculous side. Let's go to the butcher then. Nine, 18. Oh, come on. Only 40, what? He's got all the upgrades. That is bad. Well, let's just go ahead and uh, put these into the butcher cart and tell the Ella to go to the leather worker just to make sure they don't run out of goods today. Farm. All about leather and wheat. Good. Butcher, metal worker, yeah, of course, metal worker's going strong. Main house and the grill house. Okay, so the next question is, is where the heck do we have all our carrots? Okay, so. We're going to go to the farm. Whoa, 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 wrong button, wrong button. When's this one? The oats, perfect. We're going to change you over to veggies. And you click back on the farm, because there isn't a quick access button. And why not tell the guy who's got the hood on? He's looking awfully shady. He'll take care of those veggies. A tiny little bit of a drag in order to get those there. That's fine. Let's go over to the metal worker. MG here. Click it. Supervise it. Aha, uh -huh. I think we found out how to do it. Click it. Come here. And start working on the jewelry. 
Perfect. All right, I'm going to have to drop Star Dog a note and let him know exactly how to fix this. Very nice. Okay. So we'll be able to make a ton of gold medallions until Star Dog goes in there and nerfs it because it is kind of OP. Just a little bit overpowered. Might as well put everything up in there. Up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye bye. Nice. Let's take a look at our house cart. Let's see how. One more day, I think it's going to be. 666 seconds. Oh, yeah, tomorrow it should be coming in. And we'll watch our payday fly. Oh, 12 noon with a save. 4 and 4. Getting 6. Boom. Let's just go and take a look through all their businesses, see if anybody is in peril of running out of work. Okay, why? Oh, because they're at a meet again. Alright, let's bring the meet up here. And we'll get this guy. Going to town on leather as well. May as well. May as well. But the trading post is going to start getting all our carcasses. This is just nuts having all this meat around. There we go. That's one way to do it. Okay, so let's go back to the farm. Where is the farm up here? Oh, nope. We're going to go back over here. Two, and four, and eight. Woohoo! Gotta love that. Alright, so, close you down. Tell the gargoyle to come here. Supervise, supervise, supervise. Alright, let's go back over here to gold jewelry. Oh, now I can supervise. Okay, tell Gargoyle to come here. Then come here to supervise. Let him go for like five minutes. Yep, waving his arms fanatically. Come over here. And then have you go back to work. Nice, and that speeds up the gold. So, hee hee hee, if you want to have some gold before the next update comes out or gold medallions, uh, mass produce them, that's how you do it. Now, one thing I'm noticing here is they must have nerfed. Yeah, they did. They they changed the prices on these. Big time. Not nearly making as much money as we used to. And it's a struggle every day as it is, but don't worry, we have, uh, there's a gentleman named uh, Talamir that's in the discords, who's, uh, been helping out doing the math and things like that for Star Dog and you know offering some suggestions and that so things will change things will change that's for sure and the only thing that I can't wait for change is this leather worker this is kind of ridiculous well not kind of just extremely ridiculous okay so Sometime today, please. That's the slowest production values of anything in the world. All right. We're just going to wait here until 1400 hours. All right. We slowed her down. Three here. 11 here. Nice. Now let's go to the leather worker. And we'll get you to drop off at the metal worker shop. Reason why I'm doing this is because these carts, as long as they're not in motion, are like a safe. They're like a bank. Or a vault.
So by doing this, we'll be able to uh, get ourselves just a little bit extra money out of everything. Excellent other worker. He's got nothing there. All right. So the soup kitchen. They're doing all right. Liquor store. All right. We got ourselves a cart that we got to upgrade, apparently. Okay. So let's take a look and see. Soup kitchen, do you have? No, you don't have any of that, so... the metal worker I want metal worker I want soup kitchen or liquor store sorry there we go you gotta go to the soup kitchen soup kitchen there we go now we go back over to the metal worker take these two woohoo we got 13 in a day guys I wanted to get 16 in one day we got 13 let's go over here and take a look at Norbury they got four. Three. Nothing here. Norbury Merchant Camp. Ouch. Nine. Eleven. Nobody's selling anything. Like, my whole market has just gone completely downhill. Oh, now they got two here. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have to, I guess. Uh, huh. Are you not working, buddy? Let's just double check him. Oh, he's working. Okay. Just extremely slow. Alright, let's bring up the metal worker. And we'll go ahead and just tell this to go to Norbury. That way we got the money for the night. Boy, are we ever going to get the money for the night? Should be able to now start saving up enough here for the next few days. To wait for the caravan to come back. Have a big old amount of money. Oh yeah, look at that. 11,020. Beautiful. Let's go through and start at the top. Soup kitchen, you get your first upgrades. Hey, soup kitchen's good. Let's go to the cart. And there we go. The kitchen's done. Liquor store cart. Fourteen hundred. And there we go. So we now have all the uh, the two ale houses in Norbury all updated. Very nice. Let's just once again just double check on that main house here. Oh, she'll be coming in home tomorrow, that's for sure. Yeah, see, now he's not making anything here, even though he's producing. So if we go here, and then we go back here. There we go, now he's producing. Okay, so there is some major uh, issues when it comes to the supervising and that, so I will definitely point that out to Stardog. So if your guy continues producing after it shuts down, it just stops its uh, production. Got it. But hey, I mean, come on, we got 13! Like we got a $10,000 payday! Woo! Got like that. That's not something to laugh at, that's for sure. Hey, who's got soups? They got soups? Grillhouse got soups? Grillhouse has got soups. Very nice. Hmm, bakery's starting to get caught up. Starting to get a bit of a head. And leather worker, don't need to worry about. The farm. Okay. This is where the fun stuff starts to happen. We go tea, and we go eggs, leather, 
and hide. You're just going to go to the training post. There. Thank you. Training post is getting quite a bit. That's fantastic. That's good for me. I don't mind. Stacking them up. been there already. There we go. So, perfect. We're about to lose a whole bunch of money due to wages. Ooh! $4,000. Just like that. Gone. Disappeared. Let's see. How's he doing? He's halfway. So, we'll just go ahead here and make it to the next day. Hopefully, we'll see the money come in from the main house. Are you guys ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Cha ching! Eleven thousand eight hundred and forty dollars, guys. So we just got ourselves caught back up. So what we just sold or what we just upgraded here was taken care of by that caravan. So what we need to do now is go down to the trading post and I think whiskey is fully upgraded. Excellent. So let's just go ahead here. Take good old whiskey. I thought we could put 60 in a cart. Uh, I guess not. Actually, no, we'll take the 20 out and put it here. 55 here. Is that going to fix the card as well? Of course not. Of course not. Son of a bitch. Okay, so good to know that this trading thing, or the, this here, does not work on the cards at all. So I'm going to have to let Stardog know about that as well. Fifty. Fifty. Now, is there anybody else up here who's got more? Good there. Okay. Hmm, yes, mead. Are you kidding me? I can't just take in single increments? Hello? Some time today, please? Alright, there we go. Alright, we're going to take these 60 mead. Put the alehouse. And we're just going to send these over to the soup kitchen. And as always, guys, if...